Monday. Well, technically it's Easter Monday. I woke up about an hour ago. Sorry, there was technical difficulties with my vlog. I have no idea what happened, but it just didn't upload overnight in time to be up at, I usually upload at 5 a.m. Perth time. Um, and yeah, it was still processing when I woke up at like seven. So yeah, it's up now. I think it ended up going up at around nine o'clock Perth time. <laughs> So sorry if you were from um, the US. So I usually upload early so I can like get the US followers at night, um, but they would have been sleeping surely by then when I uploaded it, but oh well, I'm sure they've got something to look forward to in the morning. But yeah, today I am not going to the gym because uh, Haley's not working because it's Easter Monday. So I might just go and do some steps or I wonder if Pilates open. So yeah, today I'm gonna clean the house. I've got to sort out my washing, put my clothes away. Um, I might mop the floors, vacuum, the boring stuff. What have I got this week? Oh, I've got my little weekly planner. I've got naturopaths on Thursday. So I'm going for a follow up and hopefully she'll have my results from my blood test by then. So we'll see what she says. I've got a meeting also on Thursday, getting my nails done on Friday. And then I've got PT three times this week. And that's pretty much um, everything that I've got scheduled in this week. Another quite quiet week, but then with my job on social media, that can change in the blink of a second. So like I might have a quiet week so far, but I could get an email from my management or an email from a company saying, hey, I wanna, oh, actually I've got to edit my Princess Polly haul. Let me write that down. Um, yeah, so it could just change. I could get an email from my manager saying, hey, this brand urgently wants to work with you this week. We'll try and get the product out ASAP. Um, or if you have the product already and you're, you're, you know, you're willing to work with them, can you go live on this date? Like that can change like that. So far, I don't really have the busiest week, but like I said, that can change. And um, yeah, I've got some brands that I work with that I don't have like a specific posting date so I can post whenever in the month. So I might actually schedule that in this week because it's quite quiet. So I'm going to go and pack up, start cleaning the house and yeah, I need to start packing orders as well. Cause I got so many overnight from the sale. Um, and yeah. Hey guys, so I actually haven't picked up the camera at all today. It's, I think it's like eight o'clock. I'm just about to go for a shower um, and hop into my PJs and watch Married at First Sight. Is anyone else watching it this year? Oh my God, it's hectic. Um, yeah, didn't vlog today. I was literally packing orders the majority of the day. Um, and tomorrow, well, I actually got my period today. So, it was so funny, I was doing a QA and a on my Instagram and I was answering a question about my period and like I went to the bathroom. This was when I was at the gym on the treadmill. I went to the bathroom because I needed to pee, got my period and I was like, what do you mean? I had to shove toilet paper down there because Peter was still not finished. So yeah, it was fine. Like it, I don't usually get heavy periods anyway and I never know when they're going to come. Like they're so, like I never get cramps. It's like... I just don't know that I have my period. So that means I have to go tomorrow to get another blood test. So I had to get one when I was fasted, not on my period, and then another blood test 
actually I don't have to fast tomorrow um, when I'm on day two of my period, which is tomorrow. So I'm going to go do that after training. And I did check with my naturopath and I asked her, am I able to go to the gym and train and then go and get my blood test? And she said, yeah, that should be fine. Just stay hydrated. So um, after my PT, which is at eight o'clock, I think tomorrow, I'm going to go and get a blood test. So I'm just going to go straight back to that place that I went last time so they can just get it in one go. The specialist clinic in Osborne Park, honestly, they were amazing. So I'm going to go straight there. Um, and yeah, I just thought I'd update you guys because yeah, I haven't updated you guys at all today. I'm going to go have a shower. And yeah, like I said, I'm going to sit down, relax and watch Married at First Sight. So I will chat to you guys tomorrow morning. Tuesday I'm just having my pre-workout and I'm about to go to do my PT session with Hayley and then I don't know if I'll come home and eat yeah I might come home and eat and then go to do my blood test because I don't have to be fasted and I don't want to be feeling faint especially after working out I did check with my naturopath and she said it's fine um, that I do a workout before. So yeah, I might come home, have a coffee, drink plenty of water. Um, I drank heaps yesterday actually. And yeah, go for my blood test. So yeah, that's the plans for today. Um, I need to book a pickup actually. I need to message them um, to come at one point today. I've got about 220 parcels, which is amazing over the weekend. You guys took advantage of the sale. But yeah, that's pretty much all I have to do. Oh yeah, I need to edit my Princess Polly video, which I might do today. Yeah, I'm gonna finish that today and then send it to them. That's pretty much what I'm getting up to today. So I'm gonna go finish this and then head to my PT session. I'm not okay. I'm really not okay. Why do I still have this jumper on? I'm literally sweating like a mad woman. Look at my face, holy shit. I've got my seatbelt on, why am I reaching for it? So I, my what delivery? We did lower body and she killed me. So today was uh, low rep, heavy weight. And we do that once a week. And then we do high rep, low weight or lower weight, another session. And then um, my other session is full body, which is tomorrow. I'm pretty sure that's my workout routine that's what I think it is anyways but um yeah tomorrow will be full body obviously I didn't go on Monday because it was a public holiday and she wasn't working so I'll be training Tuesday Wednesday and Friday this week and then I might go Pilates on Thursday yeah so I usually go yeah Monday Wednesday and Friday and then Pilates Tuesday and Thursdays why haven't I got the aircon on am I okay I'm gonna go home now have a shower eat some brekkie and then go and get my blood test and Peter's calling me bye I finally finished posting, let me just put everyone's address away, posting all of the sale. Three massive bags and then that's for DHL, which is international. But yeah, I've been a busy gal the past three days. I literally still haven't eaten since I got home. So I'm just gonna make what I normally make, eggs, avocado, on sandwich thins. I feel like it's just my go-to at the moment. I'm gonna make that. I also got a delivery from Waves actually that I ordered about a week ago. I got a jumper for me and I ordered uh, Peter a top. So I'll show you guys what I got. I'm gonna make Brecky. This is the Stack Seamless. Um, I don't know if they still have them on the website, but um, this shade sold out so quick. Um, okay, I'm gonna make brekkie now. I think Oz posts here. Even though I know it's in the box, because 
<laughs> I ordered it. Alright. I ended up getting a top for Peter. Well, actually, both of these can be for Peter. Well, it looks a bit big. What size did I end up getting? Large. Why did that say $40? I literally spent $150, unless that's what they've bought it for, but they've kept $40 on there. I'm so confused. Yeah, I got in this top. I guess I could wear it as well, TBH, which is a bit cute. And then I just got a jumper. Hopefully it fits okay. I ended up getting a large. Oh, I love the color. It's so cool. It's really soft on the inside. It's a Kanye West jumper. Oh my God, I love it. <gasps> Why is it dirty? Oh my God, it's dirty. I don't know how well you can see that. That surely wasn't me. My hands were... Is that dirt? I'm so confused. It fits really nice though. I'm going to have to check that out because my hands, I literally just washed them. That's so bizarre. Okay, just got my blood test. Again, they are just so freaking confident, I guess, because... It's like a specialist place and they just would know what they're doing, I guess. Um, yeah, she got it first go. I even warned her and she was like, it seems fine. And I was like, okay, like just super confident. Um, so yeah, got my blood test. Now I'm going to go home. Oh yeah, by the way, update on the jumper. I contacted them obviously and they actually called me. The customer service is pretty good. Um, they were like, oh, we've had that issue in the past. Like it's from like the embroidery on it because it's like raised and it's kind of like, it's like a weird material. So then I freaked out thinking like, can I even wash this without it like going all funny? And they think that it's okay to wash, but um, yeah, they're just going to replace it for me because they obviously didn't notice the marks on it. Um, but yeah, apparently the marks are from like the embroidery of the letters. But yeah, we'll see how that goes. Um, so yeah, I need to go to the post office to drop those parcels off. And I probably would have some parcels to pick up actually. So yeah, I'm going to go post office. And then I've just got some like admin and editing to do when I get home. Um... But yeah, I just thought I'd give you guys an update on the blood test. Okay, I just went to the post office and then I ducked into Woolies because I'm obsessed with these iced coffees. Yum. I'll open some of my mail. Alright. Ooh, Fenty Beauty. New Fenty Skin. What's this? We've got a moisturizer and then what are these? Ease Drop Blurring Skin Tint. I like the sound of that actually. Oh my god, look at them. I'm excited. I'll definitely try them because I've been very minimal makeup recently. But I'll definitely try those. Thank you, Fenty. Oh my god, cute. Blush and Dewy Skin Duo. Oh my god, cute little mask. You never really know when we're going to be wearing masks again. So, I don't have enough cute masks. This one's actually really nice. Little mask. Blush and Bloom. So it's like a two-in-one product, I'm guessing. Oh, I like that. Wait. That is the cutest thing I've ever seen. I honestly thought that it was whipped cream. Like when I opened it, I was like, this is a bit cool. Okay, so Sunday Body. That is such a cool concept. Look at this. They're whipped shower foams. But like they're in, oh my God, they smell so good. Orange Crush, Juicy Pear, that is so clever. I'm scared. 
scared. Okay. That's a literal whipped cream. Oh my God, it smells so good. Their packaging is honestly on point and it's very, very Insta-worthy. <laughs> just figuring out that I can literally do this with my little handheld tripod. I've literally been, how have I not known that? Like if I needed to film from like a downwards angle, so like for example like this, I could have just done that. What I have been doing is putting freaking books and shit underneath it to like lean it. And like when I'm on the table, I never realize I could have just gone like this. So you can see my face. I'm always putting it on something. I was like, surely this little contraption can do something more. It can, yeah. Anyways. Back to the time lapse. Hey guys, happy Wednesday. Oh, I've got low battery on my watch. Um, I just finished up at the gym with Hayley. We did upper body actually, and then at the end we did a bit of the lower body. Um, I'm dead. So I need to go home, pack orders from last night because I'm still getting so many in from the sale. I've decided to extend it actually until Probably next Monday, I think, just because I want to give everyone a good opportunity to grab what they want. So yeah, it'll probably be extended until like the day you're watching this, which is Monday. Um, so yeah, we're also getting the uh, silver and gold verme, the um, threaders and then the drop studs. We're getting them this week, so I'll probably have them up. Actually, I think it's coming today, so I might have it up even tonight or tomorrow. Um, so yeah, these threaders are literally amazing. I wear the 9K ones, but if you want the other materials, it'll be online soon. Oh, probably already online now while you're watching this. But um, yeah, I also did a little skin update yesterday on my Instagram um, and showed you my skin. Like, I just can't believe the transformation in it. Like, I just feel so much more confident, so much better. I just feel like myself um when my skin's like this because I don't really wear a lot of makeup and obviously when I was struggling with bad skin I've felt the need to like when I went to the gym I had to like at least put some powder on just because my face was so red I had so much redness here um but yeah it's just like it's cleared up so much and I'm so freaking happy makes me want to like film makeup videos and yeah I'm just so freaking happy. Um, I do have my naturopath appointment, my follow-up on Thursday. So I might even see if I can do a little cheeky film in there just to see what she says. Um, but I'll obviously like tell you guys because she would have had my test results from my two blood tests. So she'll be able to tell me the results of that and what we're going to do if something's not right or whatever. So yeah, I'm really excited to hear what she has to say. So I'll definitely keep you in the loop. Oh yeah, I'm going to go get my brows um, threaded today. I'm just going back to faded where I went to get my eyebrows laminated. They still look really good. I think I got them done around three weeks ago, maybe even longer. I'm going to go home, pack the orders and have some breakfast. Hey guys, so I went and got my eyebrows done today well maybe like two hours ago so i got them waxed and tinted slightly so that's why they're a little bit dark but i get them tinted a bit darker because it obviously fades over time 
Um, but we are actually just about to go and see a movie for the, I think it's called Voyages premiere. We were invited to it. So I wasn't sure whether to go like dressy or casual. So this is what I'm wearing. Um, if this is just the staple and hue top that I wore actually out to dinner the other night. And then these pants are glassons. I got them ages ago in Queensland. I'm going to actually change my shoes because I'm not going to wear these. I'm just going to wear my, um, other slides. I can't remember the last time. We went and saw a movie, like I feel like it was last year. Um, so yeah, I will keep you guys updated. Hey guys, okay, I didn't vlog this morning because I was in a bit of a rush. I had lots of orders to pack, but I just got to my naturopath appointment. Hopefully I can film some and she lets me. Um, but yeah, I will let you know what she says about my blood test results, if she's got them. I don't think she would have gotten my last one that I had two days ago, but my first one she would have definitely gotten. But um, yeah, I'll see if I can film. If not, I'll update you guys after. Yesterday, do you feel like it's gone better already? Yeah, I mean, oh, it's probably a combination of things. I'm definitely, I feel like my skin is way, way, way better. definitely see that you're ovulating which is amazing. A lot of women with PCOS, especially with, if you're having, having long cycles, it's not uncommon for women to actually not ovulate and get a period. Um, your estrogen is maybe, if anything, a little bit higher than what I'd like it to be. Uh, so almost two months maybe? So that was now. Yeah. And then my last period was February. Before that, I didn't get it for two months. Two months. Yeah. November. But I think if we could get you to having only consistently 35 day cycles, yeah. I think it would be a good thing. Okay. Often women with PCOS, not not in every case, but LH will be a lot higher than FSH, so yours isn't, so that's a good thing. Okay, just finished. God, she's just like the nicest, sweetest person. She's so easy to get along with as well. Um, so I just finished and she, why is there a fly in the car? She just ran through all of my blood test results. Go away. Um, which, I mean, I didn't really understand half of it, but obviously she explained it to me. So she did give me some sups to take to even out some of the like areas of concern. Selenium drops, which is an oral liquid. Some vitamin D spray because apparently I'm lacking that a little bit. And she also gave me some tablets, which is called Polyfem. Um, I think this will help with my periods from memory, from what she told me. Yeah, there's some new stuff that I'm gonna take. Um, I already feel like it's so weird to think that two weeks ago. I was feeling different, like, like not just because my skin is clear, but you know, putting, taking the blue light off my phone, going to bed a little bit earlier each night. I'm trying to get to sleep before 1030, which is big for me because I'm a night owl. And I, before I started seeing her, I was going to bed at 12 one and then I'd get up at like seven and I would just feel like not, not necessarily tired, but just like, I don't know, just not a hundred percent me. Like I felt better before basically, but I've just like been living with it for ages because, you know, I just thought that was normal. But just from going to bed a bit earlier and just getting a little bit more sleep um, has really freaking helped. Like sleep is so important and I honestly didn't realize. Yeah, I've been cutting out dairy even though last night I had a chop top because we went to go and see that movie. By the way, it was actually pretty good. Um, I'm not really an action movie type of person. We went and saw The Voyages. I'm pretty sure I mentioned, but yeah, it was quite good. We went and saw the premiere in Perth um, and I had a choc top and some popcorn, but like that's probably the only time I've had dairy since I started seeing her. So she did 
did recommend for me to cut out dairy so I was obsessed with those salted caramel fro pros and I would have them every night and they weren't the vegan ones so I've switched over to the vegan just the vanilla ones which I actually really like um, so that's not really a problem for me I don't really add cheese or I don't really have that much dairy anyway so it's not hard for me well, it hasn't been hard for me to cut dairy. Um, I've had almond milk for years, ever since I started keto. Um, so that's not a problem. But yeah, um, I feel like all of those factors and obviously taking the vitamins that she prescribed to me last time too. She put me on zinc, lymphotox, I'm pretty sure it's called, which does help with skin. Um, what else did she put me on? And fish oil. So a combination of all of those plus not eating dairy, I feel like has really contributed in my skin looking the way it is. And I also obviously take collagen powder every day for hair, skin and nails. Janora, you've probably seen it. Um, I've been taking that for like two years and I feel like that product is the reason why my face looks so radiant. I literally just have my skincare on. I don't have any makeup on. I've never had this glow before I started taking Janora. Like Janora, is fucking amazing for my skin. When I had breakouts, I still had glowy skin and just radiant skin. Um, so I've got to thank Shinora for that. So yeah, I had to give them a quick mention because I feel like that has really contributed in my skin looking the way it is now. So yeah, she actually, when I walked in, she was like, wow, you look really healthy. And I was like, thanks. <laughs> like that's actually such a big compliment. Um, Makes me wonder, did I look healthy two weeks ago when I walked in? Yeah, like that's the first thing she said, like, you look really healthy. And I was like, wow, I don't even have that much tan on and you're calling me healthy. Like, what's going on? <laughs> um, yeah, anyway, so I am sweating. I need to turn the aircon on. So yeah, I'm going to go home now. I also got a package from Skims this morning, which I'll show you guys. I'm actually wearing one of the tanks, the cotton, like it's like a ribbed cotton tank. And I ordered... Um, the leggings and I also ordered a bra which I'm wearing now it's not really a bra it's more like a bralette so it doesn't have like a wire but I've been searching for something like this for ages and I'm so obsessed with it um so I'll show you guys that when I get home I will chat to you guys when I get home I still haven't eaten I've just had a coffee so I'm a bit starving hey guys okay I'll show you guys what I got from skims so I got a couple more tank tops I also really love these ones because they're nice and thin. Um, I get an extra small in them because they're quite stretchy and after you wash them a few times, they like lose their like firmness. So extra small is good for me. I'm wearing the black now. I got the black version. So that's what the black looks like on. And then I also got the, um, they're just like the cotton leggings. They're not the most flattering, but they are really comfortable. I feel like I would wear them like on the plane or something or like underneath a, like a large oversized jumper. Um, but yeah, they are really soft and they do feel really nice. And then the last thing I got was this beige like bralette bra type of thing. I actually really like this one. Um, I've just been looking for like a beige bra that I can wear underneath white tees. I actually might put on my Princess Polly one. Like I was saying, I was just looking for a bra that I can wear underneath white tops because I was just previously wearing nipple covers, but like obviously sometimes when you get stipples, they show through. So I just wanted something for underneath white crops like this and it's absolutely perfect. I would have to say that it, do, like, it runs a bit small, like this is a medium and it's just like, I feel like my boobs don't completely fit in there. So yeah, like it fits everywhere else. Like it's not super tight or uncomfortable, but I would say that it does run small. Like, you know, I feel like this is more of a small fit. Um, but yeah, I really like this one. I will show you guys what color I got because there's so many different colors where's my invoice it's called fits everybody scoop neck bralette in the color sienna and i got a medium in it and then the both the tanks are in an extra small and then the cotton leggings are in a small i think i could even fit into an extra small like it's really really giving um but yeah i feel like comfort wise i think this is a nice size i just wouldn't say it's like the most flattering because it doesn't suck you in it kind of just like sits on your body really nice 
But yeah, I love these tanks. I've got it in like the bluish sort of color. Um, so yeah, that's what I got from Skims. And they also have free uh, international delivery, which is good. I'm pretty sure last time I paid like 40 bucks for standard delivery and it took like, I swear like a month to get here, but this came in under a week and it was free delivery. So Def's, I really like the Skims range, to be honest. Like I was a bit, mm, is it good? Like just because it's Kim Kardashian's brand, but I actually do really love the material she uses and like her tanks. So yeah, there's a little Skims haul. I need to put away all my clothes from my washing, fold it, find coat hangers, hang them up. I think I'm gonna go to Pilates this afternoon. I'm just gonna have to check on the app and see if there's any available time. It's probably around 4, 4.30ish. Um, because I didn't go to the gym this morning, but yeah, that's just a little update I'm just about to do some Instagram stories now for a brand and Yeah, just have a chilled afternoon. Happy Friday. I just got back from the gym and Got changed because I'm about to go get my nails done. I lost an hour yesterday opening a package <laughs> um, I also took all my rings off which I feel so weird when I don't have rings on like all of my gold rings Anyways, I'm gonna put on some new rings that I have, which will be going live on Jazz Handmade, I think in the next two weeks. I'm just getting them shipped together with another product, which is not jewelry related. Well, like it's an accessory, but it's not jewelry, which is super exciting. It's just something cool. It's really hard to explain like without showing you, but I'm gonna keep it a bit of a secret until I get them. So I have ordered them and they're coming um, with the pearl chokers as well. So they'll all be released at the same time as well as the new rings. I'll show you guys the new rings, um, but I wanna do my nails inspired by them and the accessory that we'll be getting in. Um, but I'll be sure to show you guys that when we get them, which is super exciting. Um, so I'm about to pack an order. I was gonna pack it last night, but I wasn't vlogging, but a lovely girl called Courtney asked if she could get her order packed on the vlog and absolutely and she went a bit crazy thank you so much you ordered the cutest thing i'll show you guys what she ordered and pack it um i'll just get everything first put it in the packaging and then i'll show you guys okay here's what she ordered i'm actually obsessed so she got the wing necklace butterfly studs she got a whole heap of huggies. The ruby sapphire huggies are literally my favorite as well as the emerald ones. So I decided to put the Virgo charm with it, the lunar charm. Then we've got the York ball backs on the bottom and the dove charm. She ordered three dove charms, another Virgo charm and then the Bella huggies and they're the Milan. And then the pier hoops, the cherry charm, some more huggies. And I decided to put this one in for free, which is our new threader. And then she got the Nadia anklet. And she ordered uh, two more um, moon charms. So I'll put them in a little separate package. But thank you so much, Courtney. Guys, I just got my nails done. Look at them. I'm going to have to flip you guys around. What do you mean? Do you want to focus? Had to get the checkers because I'm obsessed with checkers, clearly. Oh my God, obsessed. She is so freaking good. Okay, so I'm gonna unbox some stuff that I got. I just went to the PO box. Okay, got some scissors. I think they sent me some of their toweling collection, which looks super cute. Jazz, we hope you love these pieces from our talent collection. Love Sassy collection. Oh my god. I love this color. I'll show you guys what I got. So this is the hoodie. It's like a, such a gorgeous, like soft brown color. It actually feels really nice. I think I got a yeah, small in everything except for the bottoms. This top is so cute matching crop it's actually quite thick like i thought it'd be quite thin like the material but that's the top super cute and then i just got the bottoms i think i've angled you up too high let's have a look is that better that might be this way. 
I'm gonna go to medium in these ones. Yeah. You know what? I might wear this set to Nando's tonight if it's not too hot. But oh my god, they're so freaking cute. Thank you so much. Then we've got some books. I think it says luxury books. Oh cute. I've only got really thicker, thicker sort of book, so it's really cool. Oh, we've got a Chanel. That's so cool. It's like <laughs> it's empty on the inside, so it's literally just obviously for looks. Like I don't even know if I've actually gone through my books. And we've got a YSL one. I've got like the thicker version of this, and it's like material. And then a Dior one. Thank you so much. These literally make like the most perfect coffee table or like dining table, bookshelf type of book. So they were from luxury books thank you so much that's so freaking cute benefit Ooh, i think this might be one of their new brow products maybe maybe not or mascara oh yeah it is their their real magnet mascara i actually wanted to try this one that's the oh my god is this a stapler that's actually so cool Thank you so much. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Do I have a pink one? No, I've only got a um, white one. That's so cute. So the brand is um, Decor Homewares. I love your videos and thought I'd send you these decor items to suit your house perfectly. Jazz 15 for 15% off. That is so lovely. Have a look at the other ones. I actually did order something um, that I am expecting from a similar name actually, but they're vases, like funky um, vases. Oh my God, that is so cute. Look how small this one is. And then last one. Oh my God, cute. It's like a little coaster, but it's obviously made of material. Oh my God, stop. Like a little, um, it looks like a little teaspoon, but it's like literally miniature. And that's it. Lucky I saw that, because that was at the bottom. I easily could have accidentally um, not seen that and threw it in the bin, but thank you so much. I'm so excited. A new foundation actually I've seen it online the Kat Von D foundation that everyone's raving about is it oh no sorry the new lip glosses whoops oh my god so many All right so we've got a tattoo liner and then a bunch of lip glosses which one's a nude this one let's have a look I have no makeup on right now but I'm gonna Give it a go. Actually, I'll just put it on my hand. Well, that reminds me of a Kylie skin one that I have. Just a really nice nude. I need a tan tonight, actually. I might actually do it after this. I got a package from Huda Beauty yesterday as well, so I'll show you guys that. I also got some more express tape from the post office when I went. That's a return. That's a return. I also got this from the $2 shop because I've got so many pills not pills vitamins that i need to take um and I, there's some that i need to take in the morning some in the afternoon so i just decided to get one of these just so it's easier because i have to kind of look it up on our emails when to take what and what to take so i just decided to get one of these i feel like <laughs> this is such like an old person's thing to have but yeah that way i can just like pour them in and then not even think about what I am putting in my body. So I got that, I'll organize that later. That's actually a very satisfying job, I'm excited. Um, what's this? I'll go get the Huda Beauty one. I also got a coffee delivery from Urban Brew. So these are the coffee pods that I will we use. It's called, yeah, Urban Brew and they're all biodegradable. So the packaging and the pods are all biodegradable, which is amazing. I have the 10 and 12 intensity coffee. I just prefer like a more intense coffee, I guess. Um, but yeah, they sent me a bunch of them. And then these were the little waffle cone chocolate cups that they sent me last time that I had on Easter, I'm pretty sure. 
Um, so yeah, you can just put a shot of coffee in that and then like top it up with milk. It's a very nice sweet treat. So I got them and put them away. And then lastly, Prita Beauty. How cool is this little bag that she sent it in? It's so extra. Um, some of her new eyeshadows, which actually look really nice. So there's that one, this one. They're all like my type of colors. This one's really cute too. It's just very neutral and brown. So thank you so much. They're called the Brown Obsession Palettes. And they're super cute for or convenient for traveling. So that is everything that I picked up. So yeah, I'm going to go put this all away. Um, go for a shower, exfoliate, shave, fake tan. So it's all nice and dry before we leave for dinner tonight. Um, yeah, that's all I have to pretty much to update you guys on so i will catch up with you guys later hey guys happy saturday i got up this morning and went and did a pilates session um and then i dropped off uh last night's orders to the post office i'm just about to fulfill a couple now that i got while i was gone and then today's task i actually have a, I a little checklist last night um, because I want to be productive today. So I want to declutter my clothes. I've wanted to do that for a couple weeks now. So I'll, I always give like all my clothes to Peter's sisters and mom and like they go through it and then whatever they don't want, um, we take it to like Salvation Army or just like donate it somewhere. Um, so I'm going to do that because I've been needing to declutter my active wear, especially actually I might keep my active wear and do another giveaway on my Instagram because they seem to be really popular. Um, but just like other clothes, like really, really old clothes that I've literally held on to since the Gold Coast. Like I literally have like all these clothes hung up in my spare room that I've never even touched that I brought over from the Gold Coast and like I haven't worn them. So if, I'm not, if I haven't worn them, I'm not going to wear them now. So they're all... They're all going. Um, but yeah, I will do an active wear giveaway actually. That is a good idea. If you aren't familiar, I've done like two or three of them of like my own active wear used and new. And I just post like a photo and um, I just choose one winner to win it all. The sizes are like from, they'd be like from sizes small to maybe large in some things. It's depending how old it is. But um, yeah, I'm gonna actually do that. So I'll put all of my active wear and stuff aside. And as for clothes, like I did used to do Depop, but like it just takes up too much of my time and like I would just rather donate it or give it to like my friends and family. So yeah, I don't currently have an active Depop. I think I just marked everything as sold. I've had a few questions asking about it actually. Um, yeah, I just, I don't have time for it. And yeah, I just, I honestly can't <laughs> can't be bothered with depop it's like a freaking business in itself especially like i feel like if i did put all my stuff on depop i would need to like hire someone to do it because it's so time consuming because it's all like manual um i can't just print off labels like i'm doing now like i have to do it all manually unless there is probably a way now i don't know but yeah depop isn't for me it's i've got way too much um yeah i literally don't have the time for it so um, yeah, that's what I'm going to do today. So I'll set you guys up and film a time lapse. Um, I want to clean this room a little bit. It's actually quite tidy. I just want to vacuum it and like wipe everything down. Um, and then we need to uh, cut up all of our recycling like cardboard from like deliveries and just like my packaging and stuff. So yeah, that's the plans for today. So I will keep you updated. so far that has been cleared i've just kind of hung up i need to color cord hung up like all of my crops like everyday kind of crops that i always like wear 
all of my gym stuff. This is how much I got rid of. And then this side doesn't really look too cleaned out. Like, this was pretty jam-packed. Probably could go in again. <laughs> but now I'm just sorting out the cubes here. Majority of my bags are in the other room. But I need to fill those with some cute stuff. But yeah, that's what it looks like so far. I just need to colour coordinate it and fix up this mess at the bottom. Sunday everyone so like you saw that was my current concoction so yeah my beauty brainer and renew plus for collagen and then I'm just mixing my vitamin D spray because it's kind of like an oil based consistency it's like I don't have it by itself I just either mix it in with this or my smoothies and I don't taste it at all and basically with those drops it's basically for like thyroid hormone support um, so yeah, she prescribes me 10 drops a day. I don't know if I'll be on that like for a while. I think it might be just temporary, but yeah, I also mix it in with either smoothies or this and I can't even taste it. Yeah, that's what I've been having every day. And then like you saw, so in the mornings I'm having my polyfem, which I'm pretty sure helps with my periods. And then, um, I'll have one of my lymphotox, which actually helps with clearing up your skin, which I feel like, you know, I only really just noticed my changes in skin since I started seeing her more dramatically. Like I feel like, I think I said to her, my skin's probably improved by like 60% since I saw her and started taking her prescribed vitamins. So I would say Lymphotox is working. Um, so far i guess so yeah i'm on lymphotox so i take two of those tablets a day one in the morning and one at night a fish oil tablet and my zinc tablet um and that's everything that i am currently on vitamin wise um so yeah i thought i would give you guys an update this is my skin without any makeup on i just have my skincare i've just been using the same skincare as i've been using the past couple of weeks but yeah like I've said, I'm really happy with how my skin's going. I feel amazing. When I did see her, she did also give me other advice, which I did mention. So like taking off the blue light and even like changing the my phone to like the black slash dark version instead of the white version. Try to have your brightness down like majority of the time that you're on your phone unless like I need to edit a photo or something. Um, so I have been doing that. I've got it permanently on my laptop. So whenever I'm on my laptop, like packing orders, editing videos, it's always on the warm setting. Definitely recommend if you work at an office or if you have an office job or if you have a job where you're constantly looking at screens, definitely recommend that because it's definitely helped me. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much a little update on where I'm at at the moment. Peter's just gone to the gym. I'm having a day off today. Usually I would go and get my steps in, but like I just want to sit down. I need to edit this vlog. I need to clean this room. I've just got so much to do. Also, look at what Peter custom made me. You're going to die. You're going to die. I literally have no cute resistance bands and I actually told Haley, please make sure that some of the exercises in the next couple of weeks involve resistance bands because I actually like using them for some exercises I don't have any cute ones and the ones that she uses like the good life ones are those rubber ones and they roll down and I freaking hate them but these ones are the fabric ones and they've got the um what are they called the elastic on the inside so they don't actually like roll down when you're doing exercises but like what he did say if you do get messages, he will be open to opening a pre-sale and ordering heaps more if you guys are keen. So let me know. But I'm so obsessed. I'm so excited. They're so freaking cute. They come in this little um, mesh bag. 
But anyways, I'm gonna go and edit this video, sip on my collagen concoction, and I think I need to pack a couple orders, but I might just do that tonight because it's not really urgent. And yeah, I'll speak to you guys later.